The fish used to live here. She was a beautiful Queen Beta Siamese fighting fish. She was the smartest fish in the world. She died five days ago. Her name is Juniper. I realized Juniper was different, but I noticed that she'd go from one piece of colored decorative clay to another, just matching the colors together. In the following weeks, I got Juniper more colored clay and watched as she swam back and forth matching the clay together. I told my friends about how smart Juniper was, but they just thought I was crazy. So in order to prove Juniper's intelligence, I introduced Juniper to her reflection. It was a test similar to the self-awareness test. The test that is done by placing a mark on a subject's face and then documenting whether or not they notice the mark. If the subject notices the mark on the face and it is confirmed that the subject recognizes itself in the mirror and thus is aware of itself. Siamese fighting fish are rightly named due to the fact that they will fight another Siamese fish to the death when they come into contact with each other. By this logic, Juniper would smash her head against the glass as soon as she saw her reflection because she would think that that is another fish trying to invade on her territory. Juniper didn't smash into the glass. Juniper didn't try to kill her reflection. Juniper knew she was the fish in the reflection. Juniper knew that she was blue. Sometimes I'd look over and see Juniper just swishing her fins back and forth. And I'd imagine her saying, Look at me. I'm just swimming around. Soon after, I realized Juniper had to get a proper education. So I began teaching her math and geometry and hoping that she'd get accepted to college. She would swim around the corners of a triangle and then look at the corresponding dots. And then she'd swim over to the square and swim around all four corners of the square and look at the dots. I can't prove it, but I swear she was counting. It soon became apparent that this fish had to go to school, Humber College to be exact. I enlisted her in the multimedia design and post-production program. She loved going to school so much. She'd skateboard there every morning. For her thesis project, she built a tablet application for fish. She put all her heart and all her effort into it. She was so close to finishing when she died. She was gonna add more color options. Pink was her favorite color. I never officially documented Juniper's intelligence. Unfortunately, there's only a few cell phone images to prove her existence. It is my biggest regret. I can't prove that Juniper was an intelligent life form, but if you have a fish that's still alive, maybe you can.